Hi Leo, this is Char from Charlie's Angel Tarot and welcome back my cyber angels and thank you very much for your likes and shares and welcome new people I hope you will enjoy the reading this is your romance reading for August 2020 and of course the weeklies are out and the dailies the dailies I've done in one video because then you can come back to the video every single day or download it or see what's ahead what energy is ahead of you okay let's get this well before I get started I will just give you an update um, please make sure that you are subscribed to your favorite channels as a lot of creators are also moaning and complaining about it or mentioning it let me put it that way and that they are losing uh, viewers YouTube is deleting people from uh, channels that are don't go to the channels more frequently so make sure that you are subscribed to your favorite channels and uh, as I said um, uh, Pis uh, no it wasn't Pisces the winner Capricorn came in first this week with 276 likes and then it was Pisces with 96 likes and then it was Gemini with 86 likes so thank you very much for sharing with family and friends and making the cyber family bigger and more joyful in the live sessions I do go live three times a week Monday Wednesday and Friday and I will put out notifications besides uh, the notifications that you hopefully get from YouTube in YouTube community Instagram and Facebook you can join me there as well I will be starting a new series with Wendy the witch the Dutch witch in the autumn at the end of September I think uh, I'm waiting for some material to arrive so that we have some material to work with in the new series it's very exciting I might add and it's specially um, uh, in interesting to vegans pagans and witches and if you love the nature then to all people that love nature and natural stuff bio stuff and I hope to do some really ex exciting things in the autumn and the competition will be restarted uh, but on a special Facebook page there I can see who will join in because they would like to join in with the competition you can win one of the decks the um, Shadowland deck brand new and a vice versa deck or a, you can get a 20 minute reading if you win in the third place so um, I have to um, I'm collaborating with Wendy on this as well I hope and um, I'll see you on the page on Facebook I haven't made the page yet because I don't know how to make an uh, um, a private group because it will be a private group okay so here we go with your reading the first card that you have is chemistry and chemistry well we all know what that means our hormones are rushing <laughs> yes that is, um, that's a strong magnetic attraction here so the hormones are flying everywhere and no wonder it is summer and uh, the Sun is shining more than not uh, although we have quite a few more days of rain this summer it's not like it used to be in the olden days the summers were summers but be grateful and thankful for the beautiful days that we do have we make our own beautiful days don't we now to clarify the card chemistry we have the Sun so there might be a new love coming in if you're not hooked up you've got 19 which is an 10 and there is an ending and new beginning an ending of one face going into another face if you are hooked up so you might be going out with somebody now but you might be getting engaged or from being engaged you might be getting married you are in the spotlight Leo and well you are the summer card so you are in your element because this also represents Leo now you might be in the eye of another Leo okay 
something is also you're in not only in the spotlight and drawing attention but there's also something being illuminated perhaps there is a situation or a question at hand and then you need more information with regarding to that perhaps going on holiday as this card also uh, represents going on holiday or moving home this card also represents birth this could be a birth of a child or finding out you're pregnant if you're not you're mature too mature to get pregnant then you could become grandmother pardon me or a new project birth of a new project moving home painting the home modernizing the home giving it a TLC tender loving care for those that do not know what TLC means and look at this you've got the fish so you've got luck at work perhaps a promotion at work so that you can have the enough money to get married perhaps you um, like here you've got father mother and child or grandmother and the mother-in-law daughter-in-law and or son-in-law the couple okay uh, you can work well in groups perhaps there might be people helping you to do up the house uh, or taking care of the children so that you can take time quality time away with uh, your partner awesome okay now um, this could also mean know your boundaries know their boundaries and make sure they know your boundaries especially with uh, mother and father-in-laws or your own father and mother okay you've got number th 34 so that's seven so there is luck around you the sun is lucky anyway wow this relationship that is uh, a chem uh, chem uh, chemistry that mag this magnetism that you have you are drawing people towards you you're attracting like I said you're in the spotlight so this could because you've got the Sun this could become more than just an attraction now you in the second week you've got express your love yes is more or less the same thing with showing your boundaries you are showing your boundaries you're talking intimately to each other um, you are expressing your love your warmth and what you like and what you don't like and you're finding out from each other what you do like and what you don't like so go ahead and make this romantic gesture ask to go out for a, a weekend or a midweek if you do have children perhaps it, it is difficult if you're bringing two families together if you've been coupled up before so then ask the other partner the ex-partner um, to take care of the kids you have the knight of swords so you will be getting text messages um, email uh, text messages through whatsapp or messenger or you might just get a phone call this could bring you clarity with a yes or a no or it could be an invite this could be from a Gemini Libra or an Aquarian asking you out like I said you're drawing attention or the one that you are um, magnetized to or you're a magnet for uh, could be asking you out be careful what you say though um, because it could be um, a situation that you might disagree again a nine and ending to disagreements perhaps and like uh, the swords stand for honesty and clarity the honesty will come out sorry I've put this the wrong way the clouds after rain comes sunshine so don't worry it will be short-lived something will become clear like I said let know your boundaries and know their boundaries let them know your boundaries so it will definitely become clear and there won't be disagreements or arguments in the future okay well it's only part of getting to know each other testing each other out you deserve love in the third week yes you are lovable they do love you because you are in the spotlight so don't worry too much you are trying to keep balance if you have been hooked up then you might be trying to keep balance between the old and the new I would say let go of the old and let the new come in then you can find your balance perhaps you're trying to balance financial uh, situations okay um, 
but I think you will be all right because when you are going to get together then you can share the costs together so don't worry this new start you've got the new start here you've got luck on your side you have uh, the, the, the six here that's not a nine I had it upside down six means that you are in balance Wow okay so don't worry you can find your balance in other words then you have the tree don't burn the candle at both ends you know you, if you are a parent a, sing, a single parent then it's best to take time out quality time out get to know each other don't rush anything the tree feels that you are stable and you can plant your roots down there because this is where you feel comfortable the tree has roots and only stays in one place yet be playful let your inner child come out you hold the key you've got all this here money ancestors the house there's the house it's all very small the apple and the apple is temptation only because that's what Eve was tempted with but when you see the tree it means health the family tree family is important and perhaps you're trying to keep the balance in the family okay well if you have to deal with an ex-partner so that you can go on a break with your new love then please just take it easy watch your intonation it will become clear if they can help out and if they can take the kids um, and if you are not hooked up and you don't have any children you've got nothing to worry about but you might be inexperienced so be careful with uh, with your words and <coughs> sorry don't make quick reactions or reactions that is what I'm hearing think before you talk and it seems to me that you are going to take a retreat at the end of August or near the end of August because this is in the fourth week you've sorted it out and everything is hunky-dory and you are taking a retreat it is time to disconnect from the world you most probably want time on neutral ground to get to know your beautiful new partner or take the new uh, the following step the next step in your relationship you found a way to be magnetized okay you are the magnet they want you they're going crazy for you Woo nice one you've done your meditation and contemplation like the hermit he stands for meditation contemplation evaluation and you found the answers clarity it could be in the second week and um, the ver uh, the hermit also represents Virgo so you've got um, like Leo Virgo and the air signs Libra so um, these months um, August September and October might be of significance you might even have to wait until October in half term to be able to take a half term break this could be because you're a teacher but this could also be because your ex-partner can't arrange a holiday um, free time uh, to take time off to take care of the children in the summer so it can be only done in the autumn don't give up hope okay somebody's keeping an eye on you by the looks of it ah we've got the fox be careful for sly and analytical people okay this could be your ex and um, they might be jealous they're keeping an eye on what you're doing but this could also be somebody that you don't know that's coming out of the woodwork and it could be a Virgo could be a Leo and it could be uh, an air sign Gemini Libra or an aquarium remember this could be your ex like I said they might be very sweet and nice and tender loving caring but why did you leave them in the first place they um, the fox sheds his fur but not his tricks just remember that it can bring you out of balance because it is 14 this is quite a quick reading because it's a very clear reading you have found your balance don't let yourself be brought out of balance okay because two is partnerships 
2 is also balance so be careful you deserve love if you want to go back to the old that's your decision but make sure you get clarity and honesty and get some advice from uh, a person that can give you the right advice perhaps legal advice perhaps you might be de legal, uh, dealing with a legal situation at the moment and you might get news about the situation if you're going through a divorce then you might get news that the divorce has come through finally okay the Archangel card Archangel Michael card is um, an action card leadership show the way stand above jealousy don't go back to jealousy manipulation or somebody that has bad habits you know the path you're on the right path now you're balanced and you're happy you've got a new start you've got a new partner um, and if you are hooked up you've got a new path as well with your partner otherwise the Sun wouldn't be here all these po positive cards wouldn't be here either take that time away show the way Archangel Michael calls upon you to take a, on a leadership role your love and light will show others the way stand above somebody else's drama don't get involved there is an opportunity the angel says there will be an opportunity and it looks to me as if abundance is coming towards you this could be love this could be money so don't worry about the money front like I said if you do um, if you are going to live together the load will be lightened because you will be sharing and sharing alike you might have to make some kind of agreement and that's what you're getting news about so that if something does uh, go um, a little bit skew with then you've got always the agreement to fall back upon what is yours and what is theirs okay because when you move in together you most probably share in furniture as well so make sure you uh, do the business right because we do have the fish fish and you have business luck so you can handle your uh, prenuptials you can handle your will because you want to secure everything in the right way okay especially if you've been through this situation before uh, getting divorced you know that divorce isn't fun it's war usually and I'm not saying that all divorces are war but then you already have covered yourself you, you've covered your back so you can step away more freely because the law is the law and clarity will and honesty will prevail so don't worry walk away from arguments you have the balance you hold the key there you go and family will always stay family okay you have found a place where you want to be and that you can be stable it will Im your health will improve I hope you've enjoyed this reading uh, Leo take care and enjoy the summer stay safe and enjoy everything please like and share the video with family and friends ciao ciao see you in the live and if not in the next video